National Rugby League announces plans for pay boost and expansion for women's tournament. NRL CEO Andrew Abdo, today is an exciting day for the women's game. The expansion of the NRLW competition and the introduction of the salary cap will ensure players earn substantially more income from our game. The National Rugby League, NRL, on Tuesday announced a string of changes to the women's edition of the tournament, including two planned expansions, the introduction of a salary cap, a pay boost and full-time contracts for marquee players. The six-team NRLW will be increased to eight teams in 2023, before additional two teams are introduced in 2024. Recommended. One-fifth. Challenge Cup. St. Helens handed Whitehaven tie-in. Challenge Cup sixth round. Read more. Recommended by. From the 2022 season, teams will be allotted a salary cap of 350,000 Australian dollars, 251,300 .00 with players receiving a 28% boost in base salaries. Clubs will also be allowed to sign two marquee players on full-time contracts, which are not part of the cap. St. Helens handed Whitehaven tie in Challenge Cup. Tompkins led Catalans vanquish Wigan in Perpignan. Today is an exciting day for the women's game, NRL CEO Andrew Abdo. The expansion of the NRLW competition and the introduction of the salary cap will ensure players earn substantially more income from our game. There's still a long way to go but this is another positive step in our growth journey for the NRLW. Right across the game we will continue to work on to create pathways for women regardless of whether they want to play, coach, referee or be an administrator.